Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 22 of Wonderful Pretty Curious. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> oh, hello, when did you hop down? <laughs> the jealousy. <laughs> Trains dogs. Well, to sit, bark on command, shake. Yeah. Why don't we invite Satoru too? Because I mean, we can. That whole group. The whole group. What are we doing? Look at her. <laughs> Watch this whole episode not like have a moment with Satoru in here. Because see, that would be weird because he's a part of the team. Even though we, we don't know if he's like the final care of this show still. God dang. Oh, you okay? <laughs> this dog. Oh my god. What's wrong? What is wrong? What's wrong? The puppy. You can't go out there because of what happened. So you got to stay in here. Plus, you're going to be going to bed soon after all the other things I got to do. What do you have on your face, baby? You gonna stare at me the whole time? <laughs> All right, if you say so. Oh. Yuki is right, my you. What? 
will you sit? Sit. Sit. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. As a determined puppy. Yeah. You, you gotta, you gotta jump. Jump over. Jump over the moon. No, I'm not! Oh, Jesus. Yeah. Yeah, good job, Kamogi. Good job, Cody. Okay. You just gonna stare. Do you wanna say hi to everybody? Huh? You wanna say hi? You just wanna pay attention to me. You wanna say hi? Oh my 
my god. Okay, you want to go lay down? I'll let you go. No, 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 Jesus Christ, Cody. There you go. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. Well, that's gonna have to wait, guys. <laughs> oh, it's a squirrel. All right, now let's not go into last week of turning Komogi into a tire this week again, because, I mean, <laughs> I, I loved it. So 10 out of 10. You know, I was thinking about this one day. I think I was looking at a video of, like, just looking at the Wonderful Pack and everything. And you know how we talked about how Yuki's and Mayu's gives, like, hella feels to Sailor Moon? Well, in a weird way, when I was thinking about it one day and looking at the Wonderful Pack, I was like, well, yeah, you can say Iroha and Komogi's as well. Except it's the, the crystal portion in the middle. That gives me, like, feels to the Imperium Silver Crystal. So... I still love it, regardless. I still want it, but I can't really spend money right now, so as much as I want to, I have to say no. I mean, dang, he ate it like freaking Hantaro and said, Jesus. So is he going to spit it out?
of course. The original chubby bunny. To the ocean? Or to the lighthouse? Why the lighthouse, though? I mean, would that be wise, though? Uh oh. Uh-oh. Even the squirrel was like, oh, hold up. Panda? Oh, glasses! Hypnotic glasses. just barked kind of either that was him or my mom
Look at it, it's so cute. No. This episode went by quick. Yeah. Right? But see, Yuki isn't into that. Yuki is a cat. Cats don't do that. Come on, she ain't ready for that yet. <laughs> I mean, yeah, cats like to run around, but you know, it, it depends. It, it, I'm gonna say it like this: because Yuki is now solemnly a indoor cat, Yuki is like, I am too good for X, Y, and Z. Like, I, I nope, nope, I don't want to do that. I will not be doing that. I don't care how much you tell me, how much you want to convince me. I will not be doing that. No, thank you. No. Messy. Messy buku. Girlie is like, no. Mm -mm, mm. Why the fuck is this episode really just focused on me oh, and Komogi? Because, I mean, yes, we got a whole half season about those two. Then the last couple of episodes, majority have been, you know, Mayu and Yuki, which I love, but now we're going back into Iroha and Komogi, but I feel like we're still getting, you know, the Mayu and Yuki moments, which were sweet. I, I love the fact that, you know, once again, we're seeing them hang out, like, 24-7 and such. Satsuru's coming in here and there, and it's just like, yeah, when are you going to do a show? When are you going to do a show? You just already showed us last week the trailer and the poster for the movie that is coming out in, like, what? September, I believe? <gasps> Time out. Time out. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Oh. Did you see that? Did you see that cute little moment between her and your husband and Sotaru? You know, this that we're getting next week, this is what I wanted when Delicious Party was airing at the time. Surely, that is exactly what I wanted. I wanted every little cute romantic freaking moment between the freaking two. And, and, and you know, they, they, you know what? They have asked me on that. They really, truly did. That's why, you know, I, I that's why I always, at the end of the day, will love the heck out of, like, fan art for this series, regardless. Because when the fans know... The fans know, like they like they know the audience. They know what they want to do. I'm just hoping that, like, with the person that is directing this series, he tries to make the the couple canon. That's the biggest thing that I really truly want. Because, yes, there was a big, 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 big disappointment on um, Power of Hope, Pretty Careful Bloom, and such. Um, and in my opinion, I don't think they're going to essentially, when we get the Mahotsukai sequel next year, I don't think they're going to, you know, want to do what we think they're going to do. Um, they're just going to be like, no, like, she's, Mirai is married, and Rico, Rico is Rico, and such. Probably. I don't know, because, like, there's a lot of things that they could do. But canon-wise, in our opinion, Mirai and Rico are married. And Hachan is their child, so. I don't care what you tell me. You can't prove me <laughs> wrong. I don't care. I don't give an absolute F. You cannot prove me wrong. God, like, 
dead ass no it's canonized we all know that you me and everybody else who watches pretty here in a nutshell but no this was a really sweet episode um i'm just hoping that next week is even better because like everybody's gonna be a kimono so they look so cute and they can't release acrylic figures of them in kimonos now because i need that as someone who just like okay so here's the thing also i'll tell you one more thing um one last little thing that i just bought I, a couple of days ago, so sometimes I like to go on Macari and, like, literally see if I can find any pretty cure merch and such. Well, your girl actually, um, found something. And somebody was selling, um, wonderful pretty cure acrylic figures. But they only had, they had wonderful, they had friendly, um, and I think they had Lillian. And so I was like, well, the one that I really want is friendly and such. And so I had messaged the girl and I was like, hey, do you still have this one? And long behold, it is at my job. So I will be seeing it tomorrow morning. And honestly, I cannot wait because it's so cute. Like her, I think I can show you a picture of it real quick. Since I have time before I get ready, I go to bed. I gotta make sure to dim the heck out of my freaking phone so that it doesn't. Yes, I see. Let's see. Let's see if you can see that. And three, two, one. Yeah. She's so freaking cute. So I can't wait to see her tomorrow. Ah, the best girl best freaking girl but yeah other than that guys that is my action review towards episode 22 of wonderful pretty cure if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel i make videos every single day join the master squad and of course i will see you guys officially either next saturday or on sunday when i come back from work next week for uh, <laughs> episode 23 but until then i will see you guys all next time bye